Hybrid virtual physical entities are a single entity, such as a character, that combines real and physical parts. The physical parts can anchor the entity in reality, while the virtual parts can show the more dynamic portions of the entity. For example, in a virtual human, the face is the most dynamic portion. Faces move in complex, subtle ways that convey vast amounts of information. These movements map well to virtual elements. The upper body is also fairly dynamic, making gestures and other movements. This also maps well to virtual elements. The lower body is the least dynamic portion, especially when people are sitting or standing. This maps well to physical elements. However, we do not want the physical elements to be completely static. By adding motors, we can enable software-controlled physical movements. Virtual humans are also dynamic in another way. Humans have a wide variety of appearances. In terms of varying appearance, the face is again the most dynamic portion. With virtual elements, we can instantly change skin tone, gender, face shape, or other aspects of appearance. The upper body varies quite a bit as well with different body types and clothing. The lower body varies the least between individuals, especially when it is covered by clothing. Hybrid virtual humans can be used for interpersonal skills training, such as how to properly handle tense medical situations. What's wrong with my dad? Why is his heart rate so high? Please calm down. We're doing everything we can to help him. Is he going to be okay? Why is nothing working? By dividing the entity into virtual and physical portions, we combine the dynamic power of virtual elements with the real, concrete presence of physical elements.